happy new year to all my subscribers hope you had a lovely christmas hope you had each your belly full and you don't get out of the stink pepper pot fat because your belly got full this year with animations from me and better quality videos the reason this animation took so long is because i lost my stylus for the second time so i just upgraded to a joint tablet now that i have a joint tablet my mic is stripping anyways i do hope you guys enjoy this story so here you go boom stealing first of all i'm a guy needs to grow up with fairly strict parents and i don't tolerate stealing at all but let's just say some friends are a bad influence anyways this incident occurred back in primary school i was in grade five so i was like nine years old Around the time bicycle was a big thing, well, in Guyana, around with kids our age. So my parents had gotten my brother and I brand new BMX bicycles for Christmas. So we was some big thing. Yes, I, <laughs> but it wasn't all about getting a bicycle. Customizing it was the key to where you sit on the hierarchy of coolness. Specifically, there were these things we call nickel caps. A shiny shit that goes over the valve stem. Uh, they were the key to how fresh your bike look. So around that time they cost roughly around hundred dollar up here. And that's Guyanese currency by the way. But ban is just a chump change. We had we had hundred dollar but we weren't going to spend it on some nickel caps. Yeah mad there's an egg ball and lemonade body why. So what did we do at that time? Well, since there were a lot of cars around at Adam 1, um, we stole them. Don't judge me. It was a group of us. I mean, it was normal to steal nickel caps. If you were doing it, then you probably didn't add friends. Yeah, you probably didn't add friends. So it started by just taking from vehicles that were parked around the school. But then one day, one of my friend Aki came to school with like, 10 pair of nickel caps oh, so beautiful uh, we were like hey, will you get all of from buddy because we knew this nigga didn't just buy them he was like calm calm down breeze me yeah let's need to follow me after school so fast forward time after school we linked up and he took us a few blocks away from school and as we walked we realized that every single car in this new area had nickel caps on them all forward taken from that day we realized that we needed to stop sticking to the school area we need to start covering more grounds get that good good you say so this shit became a routine every day after school sometimes even lunch we were out on the streets looking for m caps our little nick gang grew bigger and bigger even girls joined the squad but that everybody was stealing. I mean, we had the lookouts, the nigga with the tools, and those who were just there for the fun. What's fun with stealing, Malcolm? <laughs> well, let me tell you. There was this one car fully tinted, sweet caps on it. Me and my boy Akim started screwing the shit off when props the car door open. The man ran for snatch. We have your see bar account full escape, dude, boy. <laughs> Uh, and, and then this other time we were trying to get a pair of this truck when this guy spot us on his camera. This man come out the house and yell, I gonna shoot at you. <laughs> hey, some nice days. Anyways, for weeks we were covering new grounds, stocking up merchandise. Until one morning, we chilling in class, everything normal. And out of nowhere we heard, Akeem, Malcolm. Jalil, Rachel, O'Kerry, Nicola, Kimo, Diana, Shamar, stand up. It was our class teacher. She called every single person name was in the gang. I felt my heart sink in my boots. I knew we were busted. Yeah, I know, I know, and... I'm uh, sorry, but they, they, these these bitches take way too long, way too long for me. And I I got a job, I got university, and um, 
I actually got friends so I'm sorry but um, part 2 will be coming soon just make sure that you subscribe and you turn notification bell on so you won't miss it um, I just want to say thank you guys for all the support you gave me last year it has been a great year uh, we just recently hit 6,000 subs and so I'm um, appreciative of that and may this year be a big year um, thanks once more and I'll see you in the next one later